G'day guys, welcome back to a special edition of Bish Dog Mouse from the Science Sink. Okay, uh, the reason we're at the sink is we're talking about volume, okay? Now, we covered volume of prisms before, it's pretty easy. Just work out the area of, for example, triangular prism here, work out the area of a triangle, half base times height, and then times it by the height of the, the prism, which would be the length of the rectangles, because two matching triangles, all right? But what if you need to do a triangular base pyramid, okay? Now, here's what you can do. This triangle prism and triangle pyramid have the same base, you can see that, that's identical. They fit flush onto there and they have the exact same height, okay? That's because we can use that to prove a point, all right? So, by this, the volume of a uh, pyramid or cone is exactly the same as a prism, matching the same base, same height, but divided by three. So, just get my assistant to slowly turn on the tap. Thank you. Here you go. Filling it up. Now, ideally, you should three of these should fill this up. So there we go. One full pyramid. Get in there. And just leave the tap running. We'll be back. Two. Oh, jeez. Hang on. Could be in trouble here. Oh, a little bit over. Um, roughly the same, okay, the thickness of the plastic. So that's three triangle pyramids went into the triangle prism of the same height, same base, okay? Now, if one's not enough, let's do a cone, okay? Here's a cone, here's a prism, or cylinder as they're called. Just to prove a point, I pull the base off the cone, fits onto the cylinder, that proves the base is the same. And I'll side by side, you can see, can I see? I don't know. You can see they're the same height, so let's go. Three cones make a cylinder of the same height and base. One. Two. Three. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. There you go. Same base, same height. Three of them, make that. So you can also uh, divide that. If you knew that and you wanted this, you could divide by three. So there you go. Cheers. Do we have time for one more? Why not? So now we've got square-based square -based pyramid, square or cube here. Proof of point, here's the square base, fits in that, nice and snug. Fits in the square base pyramid, nice and snug. Let's go quickly through this. Mm. One. Two. Three, they are oh, perfect. Gonna finish on a better note. There you go. Uh, yep, three exactly. So it just goes to show, you work out a prism, you can work out the uh, pointy equivalent. Okay. So another way of saying it, if it's pointy at the top, just divide it by three for its flat top equivalent. All right. Uh, I'll catch you next episode.